Good day! In this video, we are going to look at question 1E of the 2022 NCA Level 2 Probability Method question. Without further ado, let's try to solve this. Question E, Part 1 and Part 2 are both excellent questions. So the business uses about a quarter of Auckland's water. Auckland Council states that about 85% of businesses uses less than 2,000 litres of water per day. If the standard deviation of business water for business water use is 450 litres, calculate the mean water usage for business customer, assuming that the normal distribution is the appropriate model. Okay, when you are required to calculate the mean or standard deviation, then you have to use the standardized normal distribution and work backwards. But luckily, we have the graphic calculator for us to able to solve this quite easily. So when you are uh, calculating mean or standard deviation for inverse normal, you have to set your sigma or the standard deviation as 1 as your mean as zero. So without further ado, let's try to use the graphic calculator on the right and try to solve this problem. Okay, so we have drawn the non-standardized is 450 liters. X is 2000 given here. You are to find new or the mean. Okay, before we can calculate the mean here, we have to use the standardized form where sigma equals to 1, new equals to 0 and we need to find the value of z or the standardized x value. To do that, we're going to put in a calculator. So again, we're going to go to distribution, which is f5. And then again, we're going to normal distribution, which is f1. Again, we are going to do f3, which is inverse normal. It is the inverse normal distribution. So we're going to put inverse normal. And we are back to this screen again. Again, as I told you before, go to variable, variable f2, press the f2 button. And now we are going to calculate the value, okay? So we know that 85%, so this area here is 0 0.85. Because it's 85%, so this area will also be 0 0.85, okay? So we are going to calculate that area, so it's the left. We already done on left, and the area is 0 0.85. Execute, and then the sigma... It's going to be 1, okay, it's already 1, execute, and the standard deviation was also 0, and then the answer is going to be 0 0.10364, so I'm going to put that as 1.0364, okay, so once we have done that, we need to transfer that number into this equation, so z equal to x minus nu over sigma, so z is 1.0364 is equal to x, okay, minus nu over sigma. Now we're going to put in the values now, using the values here. So your nu is what you're going to find, your sigma is 450 and your x is 2000. So 1, that's equal to 2000 minus nu over sigma is 450. Okay, now from here, it equals to 1.364. From here, use your calculation. So, new, if you calculate correctly, it's going to be 1,533.62 liters. So, you need to be able to use algebra to solve this so to get 1,533.62 liters, and that will give you an excellent. Okay, this will be excellent. And then we are going to do the second part. I'm taking off the calculator and we'll do the second part now. Okay. The council also state a small number of business in Auckland, 1.5% use more than 15,000 liters per day. What will the issues be raised? So again, the formula is Z minus X minus nu over sigma. For it to be a normal distribution, so either the mean, which is the nu, or the sigma with the standard deviation must be higher than 1566. 0.62 liters that is the that is the mean and the standard deviation must be higher than 4.450 liters for this to happen and for it to be a normal distribution 
Hope you understand this question and if you can get this right, the first part is excellent, the second part is also an excellent. So there are two excellent questions itself in this particular question 1E. So I'll see you soon and hope you can keep watching for question 2A onwards. Cheers everyone and have a good day.